Here we are, boys. How to Train Your Dragon, The Hidden World. Finale of this trilogy already. It's been good so far. I'm hoping for a banger finale, though. I mean, yeah, I, I would love for this to be, like, the best film of the trilogy. That, that would be sick. Because I, I like the finale to be the best thing. I, I, I'm that kind of guy. I like a good finale, bro. It can be hard to top the first movie. I'm not gonna lie, but... Let's get into it. Let's find out how good is the third movie. That's a cool... I've never seen this DreamWorks logo. It's probably because I've never watched any DreamWorks modern stuff. I pretty much only watched, like, Shrek. Over the Hedge, Flushed Away. That's, like, it. I haven't even seen Shrek 4, so I'll probably watch the Shrek movies on this channel. I've seen the first three. I'm pretty familiar with them, but I'll probably watch them at some point because... You guys want me to. Come on, don't lie. Everyone wants me to watch Shrek. Me and Shrek go hand in hand, bro. <laughs> Okay, we've got some caged up dragons for some reason. That's Hick that's Hickington with his little fucking lightsaber. So is he going around freeing dragons? Hard. <laughs> he's he's oh he's he got he's got dragon scale armor. That's sick. The Snotlouse was Snotlouse set his ass on fire. What a dumbass. Okay, it's not allowed terrorist attack. It's the end of the world! That's Astrid, right? I had him right where I wanted him. Every, everyone is just a dumbass except Hiccup and Astrid, I'm not gonna lie. Kill him! Bro, this is sick. This is really cool so far, I'm loving this. That was the funny cartoon bonk sound effect. I'm gonna headlock every last one of you. I might even leg lock you. <laughs> That's fucking kinky, bro. Calm it down, tough nut. Look at fish legs running. He's got his legs are so small. I guess that's why he's called fish legs. Okay, so that's the female night fury, right? Because I've seen that. I've seen that on the artwork of the movie. I know that's. I know that's going to be in it. Holy shit! Is this Burke? Wait, is this Burke? What the fuck happened to it? Why does it look like the circus? We've got something no one else can touch. We might <laughs> I don't know if this is a bit much. There's just the oversaturated fucking dragons everywhere. For what? That was pretty sloppy. <laughs> Astrid Astrid a hottie, bro. Let's not lie. A smash or pass Astrid, guys. Leave it in the comments. What the fuck? Yeah, maybe this is why you shouldn't have built that's like thousands of people's homes have just fallen into the ocean. Ah, you brought back a hobgoblin! <laughs> Look at this little guy, bro. Look at him. You're supposed to be the generation that leads us into the future. Why are there only like six people of that age? Oh my god! Is that an actual beard? Fish legs. Bruh. Hiccup's breastfeeding. The M word. Gross. <laughs> it's tough not just say N word. I know he didn't, but that's what it sounded like. Who the fuck is this prick? Oh my god, it's Severus Snape. What the fuck? How go your plans to conquer the world? <laughs> he upsets me. I don't like looking at him. What? Oh, man. Right. You the animation's so fucking tasty now, man. No idea what you're talking about. What if you do an emergency stop on Astra's dragon and then get impaled? What happens then? We're nowhere near ready for that. No, that's that's crazy. <laughs> what <the fuck? laughs> that's what I say. I always say that. But hey, if you're having doubts about yours truly, I'm pretty sure Snotlout's available. He only has eyes for your mom. <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. See a wedding after all. Oh, how dare you? That was a low blunt. No, no. You're it's not like I want to shag your mum, Hiccup. They're kind of cute, though, I can't lie. Just actually feeling the chemistry. I don't think I really felt any chemistry between them in the second film. Only the first film and this film. So far. Oh, fuck. If that's the if that's the tooth toothpaste dragon, then he's getting baited by by the evil man. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, toothless like damn. 
That ass. It's got fucking pink sparkles, bro. She's a glittery queen, bro. <laughs> I'm cringe, bro. I need to shut up. Yeah, be careful, bro. What did you think was gonna happen, you dickhead? Trust me, relationships are nothing but pain and misery. <laughs> Hiccup already hates the married life, and he's not married yet. <laughs> okay, that's just sad and weird. Yeah. <laughs> Tough Nut is just like the delivery of all his lines is just hilarious. He's just got a great voice actor. Don't worry, little Hickey, I'm here. <laughs> little Hickey, hey yo, bro. Just a malnourished runt with bad hair, strange teeth, and a twig for a neck. <laughs> Damn, malnourished runt. You see some shiny thing in the woods? And Ooh, what is that? Oh, it's a fucking dart. <laughs> fucking hell, bro. He managed to slip past our scouts and lay a trap in the woods. It ruined boy talk. <laughs> <laughs> It ruined boy talk. I was loving boy talk. Oh my god, he's just fucking here. Oh, that's creepy, man. Toothless. Fuck, man. This guy's good. I am the Night Fury killer. So that's why there's like none any ever anywhere because of him. You wish dragons to live free among us. Among us. Boom, boom, boom. I'm gonna do that every time I hear I hear that fucking phrase, bro. Among us. Hmm. Take up, just fucking shank him up right now. Like me, you gotta. Yeah. Oh my god. They really just let fish legs get fucking tranquilized for this plan. L house. Yeah, I was worried at the start of the film, like, are they going to be able to make this guy more intimidating than Drago? And they have, man. They already have. Like, he's the, the cold calculating, just sneaking into his house and absolutely outplaying him, despite them ambushing him. Yeah, man. Fuck. We don't run from a fight. At least I don't. You might. I agree with Hiccup. <laughs> Fucking snot out. Take the dragons to a place where no one will find them. He's talking about a quest. For the hidden world. The hidden what? I'm with him! Who else? <laughs> Does anyone agree? Anyone? It just cut away before we found out. Alright. Does look like they're heading a lot off though. Are they just gonna search for it with everyone with them? I thought they were gonna send off a few people to find the hidden world. And then bring everyone, you know? That's because the world is actually round. Sun's <laughs> round. Moon is round. Stars are round. Tough not his base. He's way before his time. Yep, there you go. <laughs> Bro, Toothless, don't be a simp. Go and save Hiccup now. Alright, you can stay. Say hello to New Burke. Yeah! Let's go. New Burke, New Burke, let's go. Fuck is that? Invisible dragon? Fuck you mean. Oh, is that what the Light Fury does? It turns invisible. Bruh, Hiccup's trying to coach Toothless on how to get bitches right now. I mean, I guess they're supposed to do a mating dance, but I don't know if Toothless knows what the mating dance is. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's terrifying, bro. Just, bro, the sand looks so good on the fucking animation, bro. Holy shit, it looks like real sand. What, you done a little toothless smiley face? They about a kiss. What? She just swerved him again? Come on now. You're gonna blue balls the poor guy. Atta boy, looking sharp, toothless. Okay, so he's just trying to design a wing that he can use on his own. It seems to be working. Okay, seems good. Now Hiccup's sad because Toothless is going to be able to be independent. Odds on Toothless leaving at the end of the film. Bruh, he pleased. Holy shit. What the fuck? Toothless is the Thor of dragons. He's the god of thunder. 
I don't know if I'm weird, but that it just sounded like the 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 white one just moaned. Lose the limp. No one's gonna marry that. <laughs> I have a prosthetic leg. So <laughs> well, unlike you, when I was a boy and I came up on a night fury, I killed it where it slipped. So I decided to kill every last one, bringing real peace to the people of this world. You're such a hero, bro. Well done. Preaching that dragons are something other than thieves and murderers. This guy's racist to dragons. I find it kind of unlikely that everyone would get out of this, you know. Oh man, that was close. He takes that stupid baby everywhere. What the fuck is she doing here? Where is Ruff? Notice she was missing. I try to avoid looking at her. It gives me acid reflux. <laughs> acid reflux. Damn. Do you still believe in him? Of course. I wish he did. But he thinks he's nothing without Toothless. Hiccup got to have the confidence on his own to be the leader. He needs to make sure he feels like he can do it no matter what. You've never had a prisoner this hot. Can't we just feed her to your dragons? Yeah, just execute her and, and end this madness. They have it, that stupid new island. Oh, you stupid bitch, fuck's sake. Take him and go! Please, I beg you! Oh, they're gonna follow her home, aren't they? Fuck. Ruffnut is fucking retarded. That is the fucking weakness of her getting captured, is that she's just too stupid to realise what she's done. Oh man, cool glowing water. Holy shit. Yeah, no, I've, I've seen this shot in like the trailer or something. I'm sure I've seen the trailer for this before. Yeah, I've seen this shot. This shit looks fucking beautiful, bro. Bro, it's as if Toothless is just the king of all the dragons, bro. He's just the best. Oh, no. Oh. Are these, uh, well, how have they not noticed this, this massive guy sneaking up on them? Son. Oh, damn. He walked in on his dad crying. He's trying to hide it. That's, that's kind of sad. I guess that's what he had to do as the leader, bro. Are you gonna get us a new mom? What? Fuck you mean, bro. That's not how that works. But with love comes loss. Sometimes it hurts, but in the end, it's all worth it. Okay, so Hiccup's sort of reflecting on it. He's like, yeah, I might have to lose Toothless because he's going, going to go hang out with the dragons, bro, is what it is. She followed us back! Yay, cool new dragon! We might not have to say goodbye after all. Hey, bro, don't get your- he's getting his hopes up way too fucking easily about that, man. No! Well, what would he have done if Toothless just instantly fired the fucking purple laser ball of death? Oh, well, L Toothless, fuck's sake, man. Why are all the dragons- all the dragons just following Toothless because he's the alpha? And they're all gonna get fucking bagged up in the ships. Fuck's sake, man. You are the bravest, most stubborn, most determined knucklehead I know. Toothless didn't give you that hiccup. Toothless just brought out the, the you know, the, the good traits he had within him to begin with, right? Gave him a chance to show it. Marriage material. At last, faithful pupil, you are ready. Um... <laughs> Zero chance that fucking glider holds fish legs. What are you waiting for? Get in there! Yeah! yeah epic final battle! Yeah. Kinda got Pirates of the Caribbean vibes this a little bit, you know? Zyklon B! Yeah, what? What they need? They need to get the fucking mind control drug out of those dragons. That's what, because they're very useful, bro. They're they're some fucking warriors. I got your Let's go! Oh, bro, he's gonna bowling pin them all. Look at that. 
You need to knock this cunt off off the dragon and then get get the fucking uh, purple stuff out of it. No, he's he's been exposed. Bro, these cages remind me of that little box that fucking Buzz Lightyear or Woody gets stuck in in, in Toy Story. No, oh my god, are you kidding? For real? That's your plan? Okay, they've got to get Toothless or he's dead. Wait, Hiccup's killing himself? Hiccup... Oh shit, I mean, I... It's, no, no way Hiccup dies though, right? Surely not. Yeah, no, they've got time to get Hiccup, right? No, there's time, there's time, there's time. Come on, get him. You can get him. Oh, let's go. Just in the nick of time, bro. Not even got a leg anymore. You have the brains. Number one. No, he fucking doesn't. She's just lying to him to make him feel better. Wow. It's not that he's actually just the same character that he was at the start. I guess so are fucking fish legs and rough nut and tough nut, but it's what it is, man. Yeah. My man wants to go to the hidden world. You've looked after us for long enough. Time to look after yourselves. Are they all are they gonna set all their dragons free? Or just some of them? <laughs> You can come and visit, man. Damn. They hugging it out. Yeah, this is a nice moment, man. It's a good thing to learn, though, because, like, when, when you tame a fucking wild animal, like, it isn't natural, do you know what I mean? They, they, they all do want to just go out on their own in the wild, and at some point, right? And Toothless is, like, healthy. He can do it now, so gotta let him go. But, you know, they've probably always got these dragons as allies if they're in a tight spot, you know? I'm actually feeling emotional about this. Like, a little bit. I, mean, I wasn't expecting to, but, yeah. Genuinely feeling a bit sad, you know? Yeah! Let's go! Great grim sky dragons. Oh, look at him. Look at that fucking beard, bro. That's what I'm gonna look like soon. I'm gonna look like that when my full beard grows in. Bro, Astra just keeps getting hotter and hotter, bro. <laughs> She's a MILF. Oh, bro. Those guys done had babies. What the fuck? Yeah. Wholesome, bro. That's wholesome. <laughs> yeah, he's not gonna eat him. Yeah, so I guess they just went went their own ways and sort of had a little reunion every so often, have a little fly around, bro. It's pretty wholesome. That's okay. You don't wanna fuck that up. Don't fucking launch your kid off into oblivion, bro. How are they gonna continue the species? Are they gonna have to incest to create more dragons? Just thinking about that. Okay, bro. Nice one. Nice one. Right, man. That's how to train your dragon. Number three, the hidden world. Yeah, no, that, that was really good. That was really fucking good. That delivered as a finale for the for the trilogy. I, I did really enjoy that. Not sure if it was as good as the first one, completely honestly. After the second one, I wasn't really expecting this to be as good as the first one, but like, I'm not sure. I'm not going to say this is better than the first one, but... I think it's close. I think it's close. I think this is a re this is really good. Lives up to the first one for sure. I think not that I I, I feel like I'm kind of dirting the second film a little bit recently, but it's not bad. It's it's decent. The second film's decent, but I think the first one and this one are a fair bit better. And I'm glad because I, I love finales being good, bro. Like this this just was back on form. This film like. Yeah, there's plenty of plenty of plenty of rough nut. I really like rough nut. Um, yeah, the gobber, yeah, gobber was was funny. Snotlight was funny. I mean, 
Yeah, they just did all the characters well. Like there was chem good chemistry between Hiccup and Astrid that I actually found relatively convincing. And yeah, no, the the flashbacks were stoic as well. Like they they were pretty cool. Like Hiccup walking in with stoic crying and then trying to hide it to be like strong for his son. Like that's shit sad, man. And I even I felt emotional watching this, bro. Like I actually slightly started to tear up like slightly this is the second time this has happened on the channel for some reason i did it at the end of raya and the last dragon and now i've done it again a little bit now but yeah man fuck what a banger what a banger yeah it's it's, it's a great it's a great fucking arc it's a great arc it's kind of like yeah i know it, remind, it reminds me of toy story a little bit like you know like the toys want to make the kid happy and then they realize that the kid needs to grow up and they need to let go of him and it's, it's kind of the same like this like hiccup finds out that you can be a nice man with dragons learns to train him they've got the big fucking you know they, they, they're a strong nation with with the dragons behind them but he realizes it's just not safe for them and it's not fair on them to use them for their own benefit even if they do like it you know like there's dangerous people like that spooky fucking weird looking man we had this film and the guy like uh, drago from last film so it's just not safe they need to be somewhere where they can be safe and realistically if hiccup was ever in a tight spot i think he could probably go and get enlist the help of the dragons to save to help him out you know so it's not the end of the world yeah, it's, it's, a nice, it's a nice bittersweet ending that all the dragons just get to leave. Yeah, I like I like that. I like that, bro. I mean, it's not and it's not even the end for them, right? Like it's just like instead of living with you, instead of living with a loved one, you, they live somewhere else, and you get to see them every so often. It's kind of bittersweet, but it's it's good. Yeah, nice one, man. This been How to Train Your Dragon. The trilogy complete. Thank you for watching. If you like this video and you check my Patreon page, I should have the full length and edited reaction to Rise of the Guardians up right now. So you can go check that out. Actually, no, it won't be up. I'm kind of behind on the animated movies. It won't be out, but it'll be out relatively soon next few days that's what i'm watching next animated movies wise i'm gonna watch rise of the guardians and Cla claws clouds whatever the fuck it is because i want to do a couple of christmas movies and then i'll move back to ice age is what won the poll that i put on youtube so that's what we're going to be doing i guess and there's six of those so that, that'll be fun but it is winter so it's the season for ice age but yeah man great trilogy i'm gonna i'm gonna be coming back watching these in the future in my own time for sure Thanks for watching this video, and I'll see you again.